It's a me, a Mega Cisco. And I'm hanging out with Bonecha BK. I'm gonna drop it down and get my eagle on and show you what you need to prepare for for Go Fest IRL stuff. Say yes, Bonecha. Show the thing. Show the thing, Bonecha. Our Alaska Worlds dude. What up for PvP? Oh. Tip one: sunscreen. Use it liberally because the sun won't stop. It can't stop, it won't stop. We've been to three events and that's been a thing. The sun's gonna get you. Games are our okay. thing. Just wait. Yo, so make sure you bring water because water's expensive over there. And the food is too. Bring some snacks. Also, get some shoes because you'll be walking. Also, you'll be walking a lot. So if you're like one of those players that play in the car, not mean, get to walking. Just finished the soccer game and I am hooped. More tips. Right, One more thing about the water. They ran out of water at the water stations last year. So that's why I'm saying bring water. They also ran a teepee. So uh, either get yourself a tushy, bring some toilet paper, get some baby wipes, whatever it takes. Stay clean, not mean. Yeah. Also a fun thing. Friday might be the only sunny day. And of course I'd advocate wearing a hat. UV rays are gonna be pretty strong. And if you're not going on Friday, I would definitely have a poncho in your little bag. I'm actually bringing this bag, uh, bare essentials, you know, bare necessities, you know, Disney style. But yes, just keep it small, compact. I don't want to carry too much because it's a long event. That being said, at a long event, you have to take breaks. This is very important because one of my friends at Singapore got heat exhaustion and he actually just went on his day and only did less than half of it because it was just so hot and humid and he went so ham that he ex he just had symptoms and he listened to his body and he went home. So take care of yourself, drink lots of water. Right? The water stations ran out of water last year so you bring some water. That's me and Bone Chip uh, doing the damn thing, and uh, yes. So I'm gonna let you know, if you can, bring food, because food's gonna be expensive, but they will only let you bring food in pre-packaged uh, packages. So what you can do as a cheat is like put sandwiches in like a Nutri-Grain box, and you'll be able to uh, you know bring food that's pre-packaged. That's also a great tip. If you have a clear bag, it's gonna sweat because it's humid as, it is humid. It's just humid. So, just want to let you know that. Just a lot of take care of yourself. On the real though, it's going to be hot. Friday's supposed to be the hottest, but either way, it's going to be humid. So, just take care of yourself. I'm going to go home because right now it's 11:30 here in Anchorage, Alaska. That's how we roll here. We're just playing frisbee with a. Uh, hey, there's Bone Chip. There's a. Uh, there's Sunny. Hi. Say hi. Sunny says hi. She's over there. But yeah, she's she's yeah over there in that general area. Hi, and then we got a uh, heifer or something. Yeah, that's the one. So <laughs> yes, but those are real life tips for Pokemon Go at an event in Chicago or any event that's gonna be hot and humid in the summertime. I don't know why they always pick summertime, but that's what they do. Mega Cisco, you don't have to like, subscribe, comment, but yeah, be excellent. See you next Rantar.